Alexander Nikolaevich Lodijan was a Russian electrical engineer and inventor, one of inventors of the incandescent light bulb. Alexander Nikolaevich Lodijan was born in Stenchino village, Tambov Governorate, Russian Empire. His parents were of a very old and noble family, but a very moderate means. He studied at the Tambov Cadet School. Then he served in the 71st Bel Air Regiment, and in 1866-1868 studied at the Moscow Infantry School. Soon after graduation from his military school he retired from the military and worked as a worker at the Tula Weapons Factory. Timeline 1872 he decided to go to St. Petersburg to attend lectures at St. Petersburg Institute of Technology and to start working on an electrical helicopter. The electrical helicopter would need some sort of artificial lighting that would have to be electrical. He decided to start his helicopter work by developing a source of electrical light for it. 1872 he applied for a Russian patent for his filament lamp. He also patented this invention in Austria, Britain, France, and Belgium. For a filament, Lodidon used a very thin carbon rod placed under a bell glass. August 1873, he demonstrated prototypes of his electric filament lamp in the physics lecture hall of the St. Petersburg Institute of Technology. 1873-1874 he conducted experiments with electric lighting on ships, city streets, etc. July 11, 1874, he was granted the Russian patent as patent number 1619. In 1874, the Petersburg Academy of Sciences awarded him with the Lomonosov Prize for his invention of the filament lamp. That same year, Lodijan established the Electric Lighting Company, A.N. Lodijan & Co., 1875. From here on he was very interested in the socialist ideas of the Narodniks. 1880s After Narodniks killed Emperor Alexander II of Russia, there were repressions against their organization. 1884 As a result, he had to emigrate from Russia to France and USA. 1895, he married the German reporter Alma Schmidt, the daughter of an electrical engineer. 1890s, he invented a few types of filament lamps with metallic filaments. Some say he was the first scientist to use a tungsten filament. He got a patent for lamps with tungsten filaments and sold it to General Electric, who began the first industrial production of such lamps. 1899, Petersburg Institute of Electrical Engineering awarded Lodijan with the honorary title of Electrical Engineer. 1907, Lodijan returned to Russia. He continued work on a series of his inventions, including a new type of electrical motor, electrical welding, tungsten alloys, electrical ovens and smelting furnaces. He taught at Petersburg Institute of Electrical Engineering and worked for the Petersburg Railroad. 1914, he was sent by the Ministry of Agriculture to develop plans for electrification of Olenitz and Nizhny Novgorod governorates. After the February Revolution Lodijan emigrated to USA. Because of health problems he declined a Soviet offer to work for their state plan for electrification of Russia. 1923 he died in Brooklyn in New York. He invented an incandescent light bulb before Thomas Edison, but it was not commercially profitable. The lamp with the tungsten filament is indeed the only design used now, but in 1906 they were too expensive. Several Lodigan's ideas were implemented much later, even after his death. In 1871 Lodigen proposed an autonomous diving apparatus that consisted of a steel mask, natural rubber costume, accumulator battery and a special apparatus for electrolysis of water. The diver was supposed to breathe the oxygen-hydrogen mix obtained by electrolysis of water. The invented diving apparatus was very similar to modern scuba equipment. His ideas for an electrical helicopter were used many years later by Igor Sikorsky.